So, hello, welcome back to Gary's Mod. Last time we were building this hovering plate thing, we were having an issue, because we could go down, but not up, or we could go up, but not down. So what I'm going to do now is fix it so we can go both, because, you know, you probably want to. I know I would. So, what we're going to do is, you see this menu, it's called chips, comma, gates, and that's the one you want. You want to go to chips, comma, gates, and I would just leave tools open, because you're going to use this a lot, of course. Go and go to gates, and then where it says bitwise gates, open that up, ch ch and choose or. This takes two inputs, and essentially what it does is, it says if any of these aren't zero, then give the output. So, now we want to wire Z velocity, and holding down shift, of course, to select multiple, and wiring it to out. Now you see, it goes up, and down. This is how you'd make a hover plate that goes up and down. It's a little bit unfortunate, because we can't really move. We c if you sort of s stand on the edge, you'll start to like drift really slowly in that direction. But honestly, it's not really you know fast or anything. But we can go up and down, so that's a pretty hu you know huge improvement over before, right? You know, you're also sort of pulling yourself along, but that that is of questionable use. Um, so yeah, that's what that does. But there are lots of other gates. I'm not going to talk about all of these, of course, because there are way too many to talk about. But I will mention this. So. What, there are there are a whole bunch, but I'm, I'm going to go over these these bitwise gates, which are also in logic, but the logic ones are a little different. Um, I'm just going to go over these. So and is all these take two inputs, and and re returns one, as in the output out is one, right? Just like the output out is one here or not one, but you know, it's one or negative one depending on which button we press. Um, but the output of and is one if both buttons are not zero. Or, I mean, if both, both buttons are the same. Um, I'm not going to talk about either one of these, because I, I don't think we really need to talk about them. Um, let's see, not. So if the, this is one only actually has one out, out input, so I, I, I guess I lied to you. But um, the one input, it looks at it and says, is this one? If it is one, it gives you zero. If it's, one, if it's zero, then it gives you one. Um, the OR we we just did, an XOR, or exclusive OR, is essentially, is A1, then output 1, or is A1 not 1, you know. Um, then output 1 is B not 1, or not 0, then output B. But if A and B are, you know, the same, then it won't output anything. So it's like I, either OR but not both. OR is anything, and AND is both, and NOT is the opposite. So that's going to be the basic gates or s and such of wire. And we're going to go over improving this here hover plate to make it go forwards and backwards and left and right and all sorts of fun stuff like that. But for right now, thanks for watching and goodbye.